Welcome back to the fourth episode of this month's Bay Pinsa Joseki. In this episode, we will talk about this blog and trying to get an influence for the Moyo. I have explained that if we don't have some stones help us to create a Moyo here, then this Joseki would not be a good choice because, for example, if we play this Joseki now, Black could get a center to limit the influence. Then the influence here is not a very good shape. It's a weak shape comparing to this Joseki. This is a stronger shape. And as a result, if we don't have any stones to help us create a moyo or to utilize the influence, then we should block this side in most of the cases. When we block this side, let the black stones connect together. Black could usually get a better result. And as I have explained that, you could imagine that your opponent play the free free invasion and you play the block and you play this. After the extend black jump, you play the, a stone here. This move is strange. For Joseki, we usually will play something like this one. This would be the Joseki. Or there are also many other kinds of choice. For example, this Hane. There are different kinds of choice, but we won't play a move here. This move is strange. So we only will try to play this move when we want to create a moyo. For example, this is a very classical uh, double star fuseki, or we will call it the double star as the ninense, which literally means double star. In this episode, we will talk about this. Indeed, AI totally agreed that human's judgment. At this moment, it is better to play this move, as this moyo this influence could help utilize this two stone. If we play the dirt block on this side, then this time, this two stone, especially this stone, is in a quite embarrassing position. So AI agree with human judgment. However, AI don't think this one's baby pincer is a good way to get a moyo. If Black really want to try to get a moyo, AI suggested that Black may play something like this attach to get an influence on the same time protect a bit more territories at the corner. This would be AI recommendation. But anyway, we will talk about this pincer. I think many of you may know the best answer provided by AI, which will be this extend and then after black play the this white will play this push and hane in the next move black usually will play a double hane in the double stars opening and then white could get a center to play this approach or this free free invasion again so we already know the best choice but I would like to explain about all kinds of choice more detailedly, so you may choose what you like and what you need. Let's talk about the first basic Joseki we have before, which will be the extend on this side. Then black will play this knight move. Why black don't play this? This will be because white may play a Tane and divide the black. And to prevent this cut, Black will play a knight move here, so that there would not be a Hane cut. Although there would still be something like this, but this would not be a good move, as Black may extend here and jump here. So this fight will not be good for the white. We need to notice that this extend would be a better move than this diagonal move. This diagonal move is a shape move of this free free invasion. For example, when we play this, 
if Y is tenuki or play something like the extension, black will play at this point instead of this point. But why? When there is a pincer here, white should choose to play this extend instead of this diagonal move. Can you guess the reason? Okay, I will uh, reveal the answer. The answer is that this time black could press here, as white could not play this honey. This cut will become a center, white need to connect. Then black could play something like a uh, ladder, but if the ladder is not good, then black may play something like this one. If white play the extend, then white could cut. But if white play the diagonal move, white cannot cut. So the extend would be the correct move. For this draw set key, we need to understand one thing, which is this extend may not be a center for the black. Because even while play here and try to jump here, white may play something like this attach and then cut. If black try to capture this stone, white could play something like this. And white could break through the black. When white attach, usually black cannot play this honey because black cannot deal with this cut. So black may need to play something like the extend, then white could keep extending on the second line. As a result, although this Joseki looks like that black blocked the white in both sides, we need to notice that white could actually play the attach in the future. Black and black could not play this Hane, as there is a cut here. This is an important reason why the professional players before think this Joseki would be acceptable for the white, and so is the AI. The AI also think this is a 50-50 Joseki. However, whites have a better choice than this one. So, we know that the best choice for whites would be this extend. And we have this move since the old days. But for the old Joseki, after black press this, whites would play the extend here. Then, what the Joseki book would say is that black could choose to tenuki or black could choose to play one more move. If black play, choose to play one more move, then black could get a better influence. If black choose to tenuki, although it's more fast paced opening, there will be a honey in the future. And comparing to this draw the key, white would be able to get a center. But if white play this extend, it is possible that white could not get a center. Even black try to play this, black have a better influence to the center. So what is the gain for the white? The gain is very obvious, this extent. Because if black try to block on this side, black want to create a moral here or surround many territories here. So this extent is very valuable for the white. But the problem would be that it is possible for black to tenuki and play elsewhere now. So AI improved the Joseki. AI suggests white to play the push and then hane here. Then in this situation, black will play a double hane. We can see that although white get a center, but this double hane is also very valuable. White could not try to cut here because after black push, white is broken. So black blocked this side and could create a moyo on the top right corner too. For example, if white play this, black could attach here and then black could surround many territories here. So there is a cause for this Joseki. But AI choose this variation as AI always think a center is more important and also this extent is also too valuable. So AI preferred this move. But indeed, the old Joseki, for example, this one and also this one, is quite logical too. 
because there will be some advantage of to choose this Joseki instead of these two. Although this Joseki white is a god, but there will be a Hane here. And even if black try to play this to protect this Hane, white could still play something like this one. In the next move, white may play this attach. So if black try to play this, then white could attach to connect back this stone. If black try to divide the white, then white could still have many center and could easily manage a life group. But if we play the push and honey, after black play the this double honey, white do not have a good move to get into the right hand side. It's also worth to mention that this attach and cut would still be effective. You may argue that after black hit and hit, after black get a tiger mouth here, this time these two white stones would be divided. But white may play something like this and cut the black stone. So there are many kinds of Tetsuji to invade the right hand side if white play this extent. So there are always pros and cons, although AI think this is the best choice for the white, there will still be some consequence for the white. However, this would be the cases in the Nilense, the double star opening. In the Sunense, the triple stars opening. The case is a bit different. Why? Let's see the, the triple stars opening. After white play the this, AI highly recommend white to play this one instead of other variation. There is a reason for that. Because this time, the value of the bottom side is much lower. That means I have told that the benefit of this Joseki is that in the future, why could still play the Hane and then cut? But in this triple star opening, the value of this attach is very low because this star is belongs to the white. The value to get into the bottom side is not high for the white. Similarly, whites do not have a black to play a double honey here because this is a white stone. Black could not surround many territories or create a moyo by this double honey, as blocking the whites to the bottom side is not meaningful. Indeed, AI suggested black to Tenuki now to play other big points, for example, this knight move, instead of this double hane. So in the triple stars opening, I don't think there would be a very strong reason for white to not choose this Joseki. But in the double stars opening, indeed, the win rate for different kinds of Joseki would not be that much. And White could choose what he liked the most. Okay, I explained the most popular variation already. So I have explained the choice between this move and this move, this extend and this push. In the next video, I will talk about this extend. This extend is also possible for the white, but there will be more variations for both sides to take notice. For example, after black push and cut, white capture. After black cut, black not only have this honey, black could also choose this extent. This would be the first two variations that black need to consider. And also, black may also choose to play a honey at this moment, instead of this push and cut. Black play the honey would be the best choice in this situation. I will talk about the variations in the next video. So see you again.